Welcome everyone to HFN Houston News. Today is April the 13th, 2020. Here to give you all an update on Litecoin. It's been what? Since March 19th, since we did our last video on Litecoin. So we want to come in and update you all on what we're noticing in this space for Litecoin and the forecast of where it's going to go before it actually gets there. So now, if this is your first time watching our video, hit that like button, share the video, subscribe to our channel, follow us on our website qfinancial.com because the simplistic way of understanding where the market is going to move is only found here so make sure you join us okay so now like i said the last time we did our video in litecoin was all the way back here on march the 19th 2020 with the expectation to see litecoin moving higher in price now ultimately on the sixth day of april is when the market in litecoin came and hit the ultimate area tp 15.12 percent was completed if you was able to time the market at the top could have got about 22 almost 23 percent bagged in your pocket so that is old news old history so let's go ahead and get rid of it and let's talk about what we're getting in the market right now in litecoin so the opportunity of litecoin uh continuing to see that strength did not play out after the sixth day of april okay the time for the market trappers to capitalize on litecoin continuously higher price did not play out i mean we were literally stagnated for three days starting the 7th all the way on the 9th of April and the market could not successfully crack up above $48 so that tells us that a change has occurred in this space and since then Litecoin has saw movement to the downside okay albeit I'll be the first one to tell you that uh, it's not as dramatic uh, in terms of weakness of the market in Litecoin moving lower I'm not seeing that so far right now in Litecoin but nevertheless I could take this line right here and I can make it as a restriction level right there around $44 because the market in Litecoin on the 6th was able to crack up above it and it traded above that $44 level for a couple of days but then we crashed right back down below it. Then as a matter of fact the market in Litecoin tried to crack up above $44 yesterday and it still got rejected. So. That tells us that that $44 price level in Litecoin is still a firm area of resistance and it goes all the way back to, you know, 2019, the beginning of the year of 2019. So right now, overall, the market in Litecoin is just literally giving us some consolidation of trading. If you were to draw this line right here. This is another indication that the market in Litecoin is weak. If we're closing below the close of this ascending line that I just drawn, we are transitioning over into one of weakness. Okay. So at best, the best thing we're going to get in the market right now is Litecoin is consolidation of trade. If we're going to hold, uh, I'm going to hold $48 to be restriction in that consolidation of range and $36 for support. Okay. Especially if we close in the next 12 hours and 45 minutes below this ascending line that I've just drawn. So I'm going to keep that line there so we can use it as a gauge. This is where the, the market action is being played at. And now on the closure of today's daily price bar, you understand that we're still seeing some overall weakness. But I'll be the first one to tell you that it's not dramatic. It's not overly oppressive to where you would expect the market in Litecoin to take another major dump. OK, but for the, for the time being. All right, we're going to play the market forecast to the downside that's how our forecast is going to play out and like i said we're going to have 48 dollars as a restriction level even though we already know uh, in the near term we're getting some restriction at 44 45 to around 44 dollars okay right 44 dollars where we're getting the restriction level at So now, like I said, uh, $36 can literally be a support area in the market in Litecoin. So we're going to hold the market trading there ultimately for support. Take a look at it on the four hour chart before I let you go. Uh, we can see some TP coming into market in Litecoin around $39. I would say around $38.50 to $39 for a TP area as well. Okay, so. 
we'll go ahead and TP the market in Litecoin at 38, which would be about 5.85% market movement to the downside. But ultimately, we're going to touch it at $36. Okay, so this is it. We're going to play this on the daily time frame in the market for Litecoin. Uh, just seeing some minor weakness really playing out in this cryptocurrency. So, given the forecast has already been laid out, we just stay the sideline and continue to watch the market trade in Litecoin. Questions, comments, let us know. And I'm done.